figure 1 shows 4 identical rectangles, 1, 2, 3, 4, and a square with a total perimeter of 144 cm. The shapes are rearranged to form figure 2. So here are the 4 rectangles, 1, 2, 3, 4, and the square is in the middle. The perimeter of figure 2 is 56 cm. If you were to look at figure 2 closely, you will see that the side of figure 2 is made up of the length and breadth of a rectangle. So this is the length of the rectangle and here's the breadth. So there's another length here and breadth here. Likewise for here and here. And we have two more sets. over here and here and since the perimeter of figure 2 is 56 centimeters we can conclude that that's also the perimeter of two rectangles as they are identical these two rectangles will also have a perimeter of 56 cm and given the total perimeter of figure 1 is 144 centimeters we can take 144 minus 56 minus another 56 to find the perimeter of the square and since they want to find the length of the square we can just divide that by 4 and we will get 8 centimeters which is the answer to this question so the length of the square is 8 centimeters long